What's up, YouTube? It's Meg. I am back with another music review video. Today, this video will be for the one and only. The one and only Missy Elliott. Missy Miss Demeanor dropped a new EP today, August 23rd, 2019. EP, five short songs, cool, straight to the point, just to give us a little taste of what she finna get ready to release. I don't know what she got coming out, but I can't wait for it. I'm gonna give my open and honest opinion about this EP. She got five songs. I'm gonna do this on a 10 point rating scale. That's two points per song, and then we'll total it all at the end. Now, we all know Missy is a legend. Missy been in the game for years. She she didn't produce hits after hits after hits. She didn't wrote hits after hits after hits for literally everybody. But I feel like this EP wasn't Missy's best. Like it didn't give me what Missy can really do. Like we all know Missy got hits like for days. Like we know she can rhyme, she can write, she can produce, she can sing. Missy can do everything. But I just wasn't I wasn't feeling this one. I ain't gonna lie, I wasn't feeling this one as a whole, as a whole. But we'll tackle each song individually and I'm gonna give my honest opinion on how I feel about each one. The first song is called Throw It Back. I'm not sure if this will be her single or not, but she does also have a video for it as well. Throw It Back. I don't know. <laughs> I was not feeling the song whatsoever. Like, when I heard it, I was like, it sounded like a new artist. Like, it don't sound like Missy the Legend, Missy the Great, Missy Mr. Mina. It didn't sound like that whatsoever. Like, it sounded like a, somebody who was brand spanking new on the scene and wanted to put out some music. That's honestly what I felt. Now, don't get me wrong. Verse 3, verse 3 was lit. Like, she was talking about, got so many VMAs, I can walk on the moon. And I didn't wrote songs for tweet before you could tweet. Like, a little play on words. Like, it was cute. It was cool. Like, pretty much saying, listen, I'm really respect the queen. But as far as the whole song all together, yeah, that wasn't it, Doc. That wasn't it, bro. <laughs> like, I wasn't feeling that way whatsoever. Now, don't get me wrong. The, the video, though, that she released, video lit. Video bomb. I'm talking about the wardrobe, the, the choreography, the colors, the vibrancy. Tiana Taylor paying homage in the beginning slick. Everything was totally lit for the video. But that song, nah. It was, that song wasn't it. So I honestly, I give that song a zero out of two. So that's zero so far for the whole entire Iconology EP. By the way, the song is, the EP is called Iconology, if I didn't say that in the beginning of the video. All right, song number two is called Cool Off. Um, now this one, Cool Off, was giving me all Missy vibes. Like, it was giving me all Missy vibes. Like, it was like, cool off. Cool out, cool out, cool out, or how we go. Cool out, do it, do it, do it, cool out, cool out. Beat, the rhymes, everything was giving me straight Missy. Now, I don't like when people use, like, repeating words in a song. Like, it's almost as if you don't know what else really to say. Like, it was just cool out, cool out, woo, cool out, woo, do it, do it, cool out, woo. Like, it was just kind of, it got kind of boring. But at the same time, it, it did give me all Missy. Like, I, I actually liked the song. It was, it was way better than that throw it back. Because throw it back. Throw it back. You <laughs> who got it? You can take it back to where it came from. And that wasn't it, bro. But cool off was a good one. Um, yeah, I get that one a two out of two, for sure. I get I get cool off a two out of two. It was probably my favorite out of the, out of those two mm -hmm. first songs. Third song is called Drip Demeanor featuring someone. Don't know who someone is. Never heard of her music. The title was cool because you no know, Missy Misdemeanor, Drip Demeanor. It was cool. Now this song. Missy and her rhymes, she was giving me all kind of Kendrick Lamar vibes. Like, she was Kendrick Lamar flowing the whole time. Like, it was grown. It was sexy. It was, she was talking a little nasty. Pretty much giving us a whole new Missy. Like, Missy done, done glowed up. She done lost her weight. She done got fine. She beautiful as hell. Look, she, Missy said, listen, <laughs> I'm giving y'all something totally different. Now, the song as a whole, I'm not going to say I thoroughly enjoyed it. 
probably nothing I would listen to over and over again. But it was cool. I mean, I give it a one out of two. I mean, it's not my favorite, but it's not my worst favorite either. Um, now, the last two songs are the exact same songs called Why I Still Love You. Um, but the first one is actually a bit of an instrumental, and the second one is a cappella. Now, these are my favorite, like, my favorite songs. All-time favorite out of the whole entire EP. Um, she actually dropped a little sample for the song on her Instagram a while ago. And I was like, yeah, this is going to be fire. <laughs> Whatever she's going to get a release, this is going to be fire. Um, but I like the acapella one personally, my favorite. I mean, just, I like it better than the other one. Missy can just sing. Like, we just, Missy can just blow. Like, she's singing through the whole thing. Her lyrics is fire. Everything is just really good on that song. Um, so I definitely give both of those a two out of two. Um, but as a whole, man, that song, that the EP wasn't, it just wasn't hitting. Like, I wouldn't even listen to the EP again. I've listened to it three times already thinking, like, maybe my, my mind would change, my opinion would change, but... The last two songs, or the last one really, are the only ones that I would listen to over and over again. Like, it just wasn't, like, it wasn't it. Like, Missy is a legend in the game. Missy that made music for everybody. You know, and I feel like she's been gone for so long um, with her own music that when you come back, you got to come back strong. You got to come back hitting us dead in our face. And I feel like she didn't do that. She didn't do that this time. Um... But I'm not saying she ain't great. Like, Missy got the Hall of Fame female rappers come, you know, award. She got her own museum for the grid to open up soon. Like, Missy is still doing the thing. But as far as her own music, I don't know if this was a sample of what she got coming. I'm not sure. But personally, I didn't enjoy it. So, overall, the EP gets a 7 out of 10. Um, she was singing. Her rhymes is fire. The video for the throw it back was great, but as a whole, it was not my favorite. It was not my favorite. I'm sorry. Don't kill me. It's just my opinion. I love Missy Elliott to death. I'm a diehard fan of Missy Elliott. Um, been a fan since forever. They used to call me Missy Elliott back in high school because back then, before I had my dreads, I kind of favored her a little bit. So, I mean, I love Missy. I love, love, love Missy, but this wasn't it for me, man. This wasn't it for me, Missy. Come back with some more music. Give us a whole album. Let me review that for you. And we'll see what changes on the next one. But this one right here, yeah, I don't like that one. If, like my video, give it a thumbs up. Um, don't forget to comment down below more suggestions on different ar different artists, new music coming out so I can review it. Also, don't forget to hit subscribe. Hit subscribe. Like, it don't take long to hit subscribe. Hey, listen, don't forget to hit subscribe. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching my video. It's been your girl Meg. Y'all out of here.